Welcome to Haunted Vlogs. Two teenagers, a vlogger and her cameraman, go explore an abandoned college. I think the word would be haunted as well. Recording start. Hey everyone, it's me, your magnificent host of Haunted Vlogs, Antonia. So I found a new and interesting scoop of this week's vlog. You'll be able to find a link to where you'll be able to download this game in the description below. About a place under the name of Greenvale Academy. So, long story short, all of the news scream of a mass murder that happened there. Apparently, all of the students start to randomly kill each other. And some even committed suicide. Yikes. For... Of course, reasons that are unfortunately unknown to anyone for the time being at least. Although it has been rumoured that the teachers from said school were part of a cult. The authorities called the instant Black Eye Massacre. They were all injured beforehand. Most of the survivors were mentally unstable, refusing to talk and showing big signs of aggression against the press and authorities. Most of them are now under heavy therapy. Intense. Although the ones that did manage to splur a few words mentioned something of blackmail. What this blackmail is, is also unknown. It's almost like we are missing something. The principal. Unfortunately, his name has been scratched out of the article but he chooses to remain silent about the instances and what could have happened here. It feels like he's hiding something. There were also notes mentioning to not trust anyone. I wonder why. Well, we will find out today, as I will be arriving there soon. Will I manage to uncover the secrets of these instances? We shall find out today, this time on this vlog. Oh, finally we arrived. We can start exploring and filming this place. Are you ready for another spoopy adventure? Yes, this case is pretty interesting. Maybe we will make more views from this. Controls, walk around with the arrows on the keyboard or mouse. Hold shift to run, interact space bar, enter menu escape or X. Save to save, click escape on keyboard and save from a menu. Do it often or you'll regret not saving. From either dying in game or the game crashing, which is a very, very, very rare occurrence. What's this? It seems to be the college building's map. Nice! You got the map. That is a very, very good thing. Nope, let's get out of here. Oh, oh, well. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Normal end three, okay. <laughs> okay, okay, so we have an ending at the very beginning of the game. The third one. Credits, Romania Chan, game design, the level design, art concept, story programming, helper programming, story, sound. It, it's, it's, it, the ending is also a game over, that's wonderful, yeah. So, with this vlogging shenanigans, it gives me a little um, nag towards Can of Box, if you heard that game. Just a similar kind of, um, well, you go out there to record your um, findings. Blood in the park. It's okay, I'm here to protect you in case of anything. Aw, my little hero. Little, but I am taller than you, but I am higher of authority than you. Now nah, you're small in my eyes. Ah, A very, very nice friendship they both have here. Damn, why is it so cold at night? I can hold your hand if you want. I am pretty warm. Sorry, did you say something I'll space it out? Wow, that's harsh. No, never mind. We shall continue to explore then. Door locked, you need a key. Because this is not a horror game, so therefore we would not need a key. Here lies our principal Castello Rusu Rip. Rip Castello Sama. You really hate teachers, don't you? We all have our own backstories after all. Okay, this. We're going to put doll store. Or a store of sorts. Or I could be your debile. 
Okay. An old clock, but it's still working though, which is nice. Just random suspicious objects, not gonna touch them. You. Are you sure about that? It's not. Ah, blood in the pot! You are so cute, but you are scared. Did you say something exactly? <laughs> um. Nah. I did not say anything. Please don't eat here, it's not a cinema. Some text on the paper can't stop me. Gonna munch on this sausage roll, why not? What do you want? Who are you? And can you help? Please help me unlock doors. All of them seem to be locked. I am none of your business here. Take this and leave me alone. You got storage house key. Nice. That's better than what I thought was gonna happen. A little corner over here. And there's a knife over there. I wonder if we should take it. Hope it's not possessed. The teddy bear seems to be hyped about the show. Oh, what a cute doll. What is it doing here? Okay, so I thought it was a shop. Now it's a fear. Oh, there's a skull there. A real human skull. Um, I hope it's just a prop. If I pick it up and it feels too real, then that's not going to be a good thing after all. A knife. I don't think I should touch it. I can try scening. Tam, tam, tam. <laughs> okay, enough. It was pretty nice. No, stop lying. I'm horrible. Oh, dear me. You seem to be a little bit too possessive here, dear Antonia. Nope. I, I can be your angle, or I could be a devil. Whichever one would suit one, such as you. Student files room, access not allowed. Well, watch me go in there at some point throughout this video. Okay, second entrance locked. To find another way. First, oh, the main entrance locks. Find another way. Can we go in through the window? No, we can't even get to the windows because of the trees. Hmm, locks, you need cafeteria key. We need to find a storage room. This is, must be where it goes. Open the door. And, uh, oh, okay, it's quite snug in here. A human bus statue. A piano. Oh my god, piano. Oh dear, I swear this kind of culture is infecting so many different um, types of media. A human bus statue. You found a key sitting in the shelves. You got cafeteria key. Here's a key that leads to a room which has a key. But nothing else other than keys. Tires. Bucket. Uh, beer and... Okay, I feel like there's a speakeasy behind that. Uh... <laughs> Toiled paper. Uh, soon everything is going to become anime esque. Let's take selfies! Nope. Um, I would like to find which anime or which media originated as Uwu shenanigans because I'd like to have a very, very long conversation with them. I am so tired of seeing blood. I don't know what happened to the students, but I can't stand seeing all this insanity going on anymore. I am quitting this job. I am tired of this insanity and I'm going to go somewhere else and cause some insanity there as well. Um, what is this supposed to be? A portrait of sorts. It's just got a bit of red, that's all. Uh, yeah, that's the entrance. So, cafeteria... Oh, okay, we should have used the map while we were here. Cafeteria is bottom right. Okay, we'll go there then. Open the door, yes please. And hopefully there is something edible in here. Pancake! 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 Pancake? Pancake! <laughs> I'm not gonna try and exuberate my voice here. Decorative donuts. Oh, I wish they were edible. No, don't eat food from abandoned places! And you're gonna cry. But at least you have the footage. Are these paintings made by students from here? Hmm, maybe. Do we all have the same kind of school on it? Are these paintings made by students from here? Maybe. I was referring to like the style of the like the frame or anything like that. Something that makes it look unique to the school itself. It's so nice it makes me hungry and want to eat all the sweets. Please give me sweets or one sweets. No. 
please? No, you will die from these, meanie. I would rather die than put up with you. Hey, see that rock over there? Yeah, it's covering up that hole in the wall. Let's try to move it. Hold shift and space bar to move the rock. Expired food. Will I die if I eat expired cupcakes? Yes. Don't you even dare. I wonder if you interact with it enough times and we do actually eat them. Dirty sink. Something over here. Damn, expired cakes. Oh, I'm so hungry. Maybe we should have planned this trip better. Potato, potato. Potato. Potato, potato, retardo. Um, I'm not going to say the next one. Uh, okay, we're going to move this. Hmm. Which way does it... Hold space bar? What? Can I just... I feel like I'm not getting a lot out of this. Or maybe... Oh, we hold shift down. That's right. Holding a wall. Oh, a secret passageway. Maybe we can find something interesting down there. You can't return. Finding a way into the other buildings will be a, 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 a task for future me. Yes, we'll go in there. It's a shame we cannot return, but it's pretty dark in here. I'm a bit scared. It's alright, we are close to the exit of this weird tunnel. Can't wait to see what we can find. Yeah! And, alas, we are here. Whoa, this passage led to the main... Oh, this is the main building, okay. So exciting, we finally found a way in. Yes, finally, we can get some clues about the mystery. And, obviously, that had to block the entrance. Can't go, it's blocked. You should stay here, it's for girls. Okay, no problem, please take care. I'll do my best. And there's blood on the floor. You can play X and Zero on this mirror. But do I want to, though? Do I really want to risk my life <laughs> right in blood? Oh, I really hope nothing bad will happen to him while he's waiting for me. Of course not. The door's locked, okay. Oh, a student ID! Aha, high school student ID, grade year one, class 4A, name Eludia Serban. Uh, born 14th of January, some point <laughs> when there's a year with four digits on it. I hope she's okay. I wonder how she, did she lose, lose her card here? One of four student IDs. Okay, so this is a collectible sort. The door is locked. Here or enter there. Look, you're gonna enter there for the content. You have... <laughs> Lulia. See? That's not so bad. What do you mean you won't enter there? Look, the content is right there in that toilet. Surely you want to film it for the views. Antonia, if that's even your real name. Oh my god, I'm glad you're still here. Of course I am. What happened? Yeah, nothing really worth mentioning. There's some trust issues here. Damn, I already gotta go to the toilet. Maybe we'll find another bathroom. Ah, oh dear, it's not like anybody else is here. Oh, there is a dress. So it was a girl. Maybe. We don't know if a victim wore this dress or not. Hmm. I see a body in there. Someone was killed in this room. And now this is all remained of them. A blood container. No! I'm so sorry for them. Me too. And looks like they were filmed as well. So this could be like a um, an execution room. Like a red room sort of thing. Dark web shenanigans someone was filming this gruesome view what a psycho exactly whoever did this has a heinous mind to them at the very least books lots of them lots of hours of reading words on paper oh dear principal portrait damn boy he is so ugly mm -hmm. don't take the equipment without the approval of the handyman so the janitor <laughs> Boom. Trying to make it cute there. With the U's rather than the O's. Bloody notes. Like literally. 
notes but with blood on them. They're unreadable. I will be able... Oh, hold on. We will go this way. We will decipher this. Uh, what's wrong? I need to talk with you about something. But maybe later. Okay. I hope it's nothing bad. What happened while I was in there? The door's locked. Okay. Nice painting. Indeed. Oh. Well, there's a little bit of a jump scare there. I wasn't fully focused. I couldn't really see what was going on. Ah, oh, a student ID again. That wasn't here this time. Okay. High school, student ID, grade year 2, class 2B. Christina Arsney, born 20th of August, a certain year. Look how sad and stressed she looks. She must have been through some really awful experiences. Or she has insomnia or something that prevents her from sleeping a lot. You got student ID 2 of 4. Oh, that thing was right next to us. That is not ideal, to say the least. Not ideal. Wait, is this game over if we touch it? Have you seen my blue teddy bear? I really need it. Please help me. I can't leave the hallway to find it myself. I'll do my best to try and find it, but if you're in the way, then I will not be able to investigate every cram of this place. Some old announcements and exam scores are displayed. That ghost is pretty pushy. Let's try to find his teddy bear. He will leave us alone and maybe we can get some info from him. Yay, let's find it faster! It's a... No, that's a purple one. Food. Hey, look, they still have the vending machines working. I guess ghosts can get hungry too. <laughs> this thing seems to work. Should I buy a chocolate bar? Absolutely. You put one dollar. No, we're now one dollar poorer. You try to grab a chocolate bar, but a ghostly hand wraps you. And of course, yeah, nice going. <laughs> no, it could be possessive. I guess I should be careful with what I eat in this place. Exactly. Let's push forward. <laughs> Fire extinguisher. Oh, there's a few statues here. Ah, the exit is blocked. Don't worry, there must be another way out of this building. Oh, we can be stuck here together for it. Did you say something? What do you mean? This? Oh, okay. That really has was the exit blocked. And it's the emergency exit of all things. How the hell do you... Okay. I expect it from Antina, Antonia, but not you, Victor. There's a haunted painting there. It's locked. Okay. What a beautiful painting. Except that she does not have any eyes. Candace's portrait by Jola Lee. Okay. Ugly paint. What do you mean ugly painting? More blood. Everywhere we go, we see blood. Well, this did belong to a place where a cult was here. Cult activity surely has at least blood as the like the least horrific thing to encounter. I feel do so disturbed by the principal. He is so obsessed with Candice. Poor woman, she is really trying very hard to keep her job while also trying to reject him very softly. She is too nice. She can't just say no. She has a little girl to take care of and a very loving and handsome husband. Knowing what an ugly old dinosaur is a lover. The principal seems really annoying and obsessive. Plastic flowers banquet. Boquet. Whichever one is correct. Principal room locker, you need a key. Okay. Seems we're going to need a key for that one. But that is not a blue teddy bear. That is a purple teddy No, remember he said blue. Exactly. That's not blue. That's purple. Or color. Need a bit more blue to it. Only a little bit more. Since purple is close to blue on the color table. Okay, those dresses surround the door. Can't go in. Blocked. Ouch. Oh, we've already been in here. Yeah, that's a dress. Okay. So we need four student IDs. Also, if we go back in the room where the cafeteria key is, the key just resummons itself there. Okay. Oh, there was a scream. What was that? The sound came from upstairs. Maybe we should check if that person's okay. Those are some not very nice words up there. 
Let's see who's upstairs. Unless, oh, what the bro? No, what the hell? She just got killed. I think we should be extra careful from now on. Maybe this vlogging thing was not the best idea. Journal page one. It's been a few days since the incident happened. My sister went missing. I thought something happened to her in this school. So I decided to come and see if I can find her. What happened here? I regret coming here. I didn't see my sister and also I am trapped. There's no way out. But I'm aware of. Journal page two. I found a password for some kind of safe in a room. But I haven't seen any safe in here. I think it's pretty useless. But there are also some locked rooms to which I didn't find the keys to open the door. But maybe if something ever happens to me, and you are also trapped in here, I'll write the passcode on the next page. Journal page 3. The safe passcode is... Great. Somebody tore it off to remove the evidence. Bah! I wonder who stole and ripped it off the paper. Somebody didn't like the fact that you knew the safe code. And I think that was why said killer killed you. Ocean oh, ID. Aha. Uh -huh. High school, she ID, grade year 3, class 1C, named Kodria Sel Sprat. Uh, born 6th of the 6th, uh, something, 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 6. He seems pretty familiar to me. Yeah, I think I saw him on YouTube, maybe. <laughs> oh, great, that's how you knew he was familiar. It's not like if he's an acquaintance at school. Yeah, who knows, at least we get to collect random student cars to show to the internet. I'm pretty sure they wouldn't be very fond of you just showing their identity on the internet. Red weird painting. Weird red painting. Keep out. <laughs> okay. We'll do our best, but we can't guarantee anything, okay? Why do we have stats? There is no door. What a weird floor. It's like someone isolates it completely with a wall. Yeah, because that would give you the... The indicator that there is a door there. It's almost like someone blocks off on the other side after they killed this poor personnel here. I was about to call it a specimen, but that's no good. There's another Candace painting there. Oh, look! Oh, I thought the girl from downstairs fell through this. Oh, sh you are right. Let's say extra. Let's take care so we don't end up like her. You sure about that? Because it's not like it's at the wrong angle. Hmm, but then again, there's no blood on her back, so it might have been a fall rather than a stab. I don't trust this one bit. I feel like there's still a killer on the loose. Like, I don't think she would have fallen down intentionally. Door's locked. The sign next to it says Ritual Room. Wow. That's no good. Ritual? For what? For the cult-like stuff that's happening here. Okay, do you want to do you want some chocolate? No. <laughs> I have no desire for chocolate. Gibberish writes on, on a board. Hmm. Donut painting? I don't think that's a donut. No, it looks like something else. No, 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 it is a donut. Great. You donut. Grandma fashion. Why is it grandma fashion? Is it because the clothing's old? More ugly paintings. There is beauty within anything in life. Even when something that looks like it has been completely decayed or is locked. I will murder you. Is that what it says on... Oh, I thought... Okay, I thought it said that on my t-shirt. I didn't think you was literally going to murder me. Thank you very much. Another lovely painting there. And this one. Pink you skirt. Oh. Aha. Access here. Oh, look, a bathroom. Maybe you can go... Now, if you can't resist anymore. Oh my god, finally! But do you think it's a good idea? Absolutely! Yes, it is a fantastic idea. Okay, stay here. I'll be back as fast as I can. I promise I won't move. Oh, oh. I wish we could get out of here alive. I didn't even get the chance to confess to him yet. But maybe I'll try to do it before escaping this hell. Oh. Something must have happened there yeah it's a big old fat game over <laughs> oh. i didn't see the floor there 
Now it's our turn to die. Avoid the open gaping floor. And blue jacket! Da da dee da da da. Oh. Da ba. No, no, thank you. Uh, tutorial time? You should move a mannequin on the pink spot. It's easy. But which one's the mannequin? There's plenty of things in here that could look like a mannequin. It looks so soft and warm, I want it. Can we steal it? No. Who knows what curse that thing has. What if you steal it and you'll be haunted all your life by the artist who made it? Okay, I don't want curses. Can I have the... <laughs> Another pink skirt. Can I have the coat without the curse? It's all for a good cause. This ugly blob looks like the orange man. Oh dear, not that orange, but on YouTube. You know, the talking orange. Ah, snakes, please don't attack without the K. Somebody seems unhappy on that board. Comfy. But ass jacket. Naked model. Not that kind of naked. Bald head, he needs a wig. And that is something dead. Dead doggo. No, poor doggo. Rip doggo. Made it far into this video. Type. No, no, actually, uh, scratch that. Don't don't type that. Meh. Don't like the design of this. Well, we'll move the man again. I, a key has appeared in the bloody water. He got attic key. See. It's the third key that we got out of all of this conundrum. Again, this painting. Whoever made it, he is obsessed with it. If I owned a college, I would have put paintings of you all over it. That's not good at all. Thank off. No, you wouldn't. So damn cute. Seems there's some, some comedy, but also some tension between... Oh, gosh, but there's more of them. There's so many of these paintings, like the principal is obsessed with this person. Random student notes. Uh, this room here. Yeah, this painting keeps following us. It's like a curse. Gibberish painting. It's not gibberish. Bloody hell. You really don't like seeing blood. Hmm. Well, at least you don't have a phobia of it, which I can only imagine some people do. And, oh. Okay, green is one, blue is pink. So, blue is three and pink is seven. I was supposed to say blue is pink there. They must be torn off from the book earlier. I wonder what it is for. You got past coach paper. Let's see. Don't touch paintings, they are still wet. I think they, they got dry by now. Are you sure the paintings that are in blood might still be fresh? She is everywhere. Very much so. For the first time around, I thought it was cute. The tenth time around is not as cute. And the hundredth time, I'm definitely thinking that somebody might be obsessed with this kind of thing. Pretty girl portrait. Not as pretty as you. Do you say something? Yes, not as pretty as you. That's what I thought. Righty uh, The statue is sussy. Don't go in front of it. Yeah, sure, absolute. Well then, yeah, the, the statue is definitely sussy. Don't go in front of it. We'll go behind the statue and... Oh, there's more to all this. Oh, is this the insistent ghost's teddy bear? Seems like it. Your ghost teddy bear, it seems pretty sussy, but... Anyways, must go and give it back to him. Ghost! You gave a teddy bear to the ghost. Thank you so much. As a thank you gift, I will give you this paper. I found it around the school. Everywhere, everywhere, eternity, time, spacious, five E's, oh dearie me. What well, waits further this way? I don't understand what's written on these. Hmm, a sigil of sorts. Why is so much blood on these statues? For the vibes, I don't know. Stop being so heartless. Stop it. There is some tension between these two. So she's always really, really, um, cross when it comes to these kinds of scenarios with blood. I'm so sick of seeing these. But if you have a fear of blood, then I can understand why you would get irked up by these. I kind of get used to it. But I feel bad for the victims, exactly, yeah. 
become normalized by all this. Open the door and hmm, there's somebody here. Notice, stop eating the classroom and leave rotten teacups unwashed, you filthy animals. There used to be a lazy tea addicted to students. Hmm. Dirty teacups and instant noodle bowls. There's somebody at the desk there, but I'd rather not approach them. Photos of previous students in the newspaper sleeping during classes. Damn, there's a lot of photos. They must have been really tired if they slept that much. Okay, books about how you can work 24-7 without needing to sleep. That's no good. There's a skull there, random skulls. Hmm, shiny container two and shiny container one. Body parts in blood source. Not blood, blood source. And toot paper. Don't know how to pronounce that properly. Broken piano, somebody there. Hello! Mysterious guy. Um, who are you? And are you okay? I am just an ex student. I was searching for something I left behind before the incident. And sadly, now I'm stuck here. I see. Maybe we could team up to find a way out. I have a password for the principal's safe, but I'm willing to share it with you only if you help me get to his room. Oh, sure, of course we can. Wait, are you sure it's a good idea to take him with us? I don't know if we could trust him. Of course, why not? Welcome to our team. Let's do our best to escape. Yeah, let's do our best. I hope you won't try anything sketchy. Exactly. What is the worst that could happen? There's a this, this is a riddle to solve. Please take a screenshot of a riddle or write it down because you won't be able to see it when you input your answer. Okay, start. I am beginning of everything, the end of everywhere, and the beginning of eternity and the end of time and space. What am I? If you have any clues, you can look at them now before starting your answer. You do have a hint. Here it is. Yeah, if you get it wrong, you do definitely die. Oh, student ID. Someone has haters. Oh, dear. High school law student ID. Pros, grade three, class two. Um, name, Christy de la Veshwa. <laughs> Born 10th of January, Friar. I feel so sorry for him. Yeah, he's got his... um. ID scribbled out and all that, that's no good. Fridge with books and food? What the bleh? Must be edible food, like it's all cake. Random toys and eating utensils. Lovely. Books about anime. Oh, animation. I thought I said ammunition then. Work stuff, applications, something, something. Uh, there are some tea bags in the bucket. This monitor has blood on it. Maybe Stuart got a blue screen while doing a project and went angry and punched himself and blood splattered on it. What the hell stop saying stuff, that creepy stuff, do you have any empathy at all? Sorry, maybe I went a bit too far, yeah. Although your emotions are kind of like that when you do see a blue screen of death. I mean Victor is much of a warrior. <coughs> oh dear, are you okay my mans? What? Why are you looking at me with those eyes? I... Man, that's not very nice. What's with that? <laughs> Why did you say such heinous things there for? Like, I know you don't trust him, but for goodness sakes. Please leave me alone. I have to finish my bachelor's degree animation project. Ah, it's been two years since I'm working on it. And I am still doing the keyframes. There's a lot of frames into animations. Can't put universe in, which is probably what I would have thought that like the beginning and end of everything has to correlate into one specific space and it feels like it's something that goes on for eternity, but alas it's not gonna be that. Beginning of everything, end of everywhere, beginning of eternity and the end of time and space. Is it really just that? Bloody hell. Uh, these things you just got to look at it at face value rather than trying to conjure up a word. The rich room has been unlocked. Great, I just love the sound of that. Going into a rich room with our new best friend. 
Let's go and see what awaits us and hopefully we do not die from a possessive statue wants to boink us. So the ritual oh uh, no this is not the ritual room. The uh, the ritual room is further along this way over here with the glowy door. Oh, remember that paper with numbers and colours? Maybe it's for this room. We can open the menu any time. What do you mean open the menu any time? What are you talking about, Victor? Okay, so there's no pink in here though. I just found that all out. There's no pink in here. Um, incorrect. I know. You have to give me that game over treatment. Green is one. This one's three. Look, blue is three. Yeah, definitely. Blue is three. So why is that not the case? Three. Okay, seven. Oh, maybe it's because of a glow. Yeah, it's down to the glow, but the circle is definitely blue again, still. A key appeared in the center. Principal's key. Love. Oh, I will kill you. You have to return. So you have to run to the principal's office without being caught. Otherwise, you will die. The room is next to a blocked exit to the right, then down. Easy said. Going down, down, right, right, down. Great. Go downstairs. Exactly. Don't try and kill us, thank you. Anyways, why are you trying to kill us? What have we done wrong against you? Is there anything that's gonna block us? Like there and oh go down, yes. Very much so down. Oh, that thing is still out here then. This is just fantastic. Bleeding painting. Uh a painting of sorts still with blood. Cute doll one. It was an amazing day. A pretty secretary smiled to me. Maybe she is interested in old handsome guys. No. Also, I got asked to show my painting and art exhibition. I really enjoy painting women and scenery. They have any things that deserve being painted. Okay. My artist's name is Jodalee. I know it is not related to my real name, Castell, which is on the fourth student's um, ID at all. But I find it artsy fartsy and it works for me. Candice is the love of my life. I would leave. Oh, great. She's the most beautiful woman my eyes ever saw. I made hundred, oh, hundreds of paintings of her and put them around the college. But sadly, she doesn't seem too moved by it. Maybe one day she'll understand my love for her. And maybe she's still having feelings for me today. Some teachers reported that most students felt very stressed and couldn't focus much. Maybe they are scared of something. Yeah, it's you. Final exams? A new apocalypse? I can't understand teens nowadays. Always stressed, always depressed. I can't do anything about it. This is one heinous principle. Cute doll. Tipsa. Don't know how to properly pronounce that. The foreign letter contains very explicit and gruesome acts. Do you still want to read it? Absolutely. Uh, these two secretaries blah, 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 know too much. They kept talking and blackmailing me. Instead of cooperating to find the culprit, they just made things worse. They deserve their fates. I hate them so much. Cleveland was a pain, but I had to. When someone gets to read this letter, it will be too late. I can't stand anymore. The guilt is too painful. I just want it all to stop. At least I got to have some fun with Candace. I deserve some. Okay. Not gonna read the rest of that. What a psycho. Yeah, we'll report to the police when we get out here as he is still alive. How disgusting can humans be? Very, 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 very disgusting. Like people like that should not be in free of society. Absolutely. Are these the skulls of the secretaries? More like, more than like, yes, yes, and they're real. Grandma painting. And that paints again. Now we know that the principal drew it. Yes, he was really obsessed with that secretary. Incredibly obsessed to the point where I think Canada should go as far away as possible for her own safety and sanity. Hmm. This looks bad. Okay, smart ass. Do you have a password? Yes, four six one two two two. Oh wait, where'd you get it from? Did you get it from a girl's book? Hmm. Yes. 
You mother... I'm oh, blooming you here! Stop it! Maybe he... Okay, for it, but... Antonio, your priorities are not set straight here. Without him, we wouldn't be able to get to this point. Let's trust him for now. I wouldn't... I wouldn't trust him. I mean, he just oofed someone. No. You're way too cute. Someone please kill me. Oh my god, I want to stab him so much right now. Okay, so remember. 461222. The cabinet is locked. Input the password. Why is there one at the beginning? Hmm. I feel like this is a little bit of a trap, if you ask me. Correct. The save is now unlocked. Oh, there's an emergency exit key. Maybe one of the doors at this floor is an emergency one? We are free! There are also some documents related to the incident. General page 4. I found who was the one behind all of this. It was a student who has been bullied by his classmates for his looks and for being an introvert. The students kept on posting memes, of course, laughing about him online, making videos, calling him names. He was destroyed by all these. Poor lad. Some transfer students, maybe it was the principal, some transfer students said he blackmailed them into doing horrible things. Otherwise, he would leak sensible information about them online. He did it for revenge. Some students got to move away and break all contact with everyone. Others had to do what he said. This led to the involvement of more people. More blackmailing to the point where everyone was stressed, angry, aggressive. All this caused so many su su suicides, killings, and students going into therapy, and it all started with bullying. A student who is the child of a good friend of mine told me all this. While she moved from the college, she is still in therapy, but it's getting better. You can never really truly recover from such traumatic experiences, but you can somewhat heal from it. I sadly can't leak this information, otherwise my life would be compromised, but I hope somebody finds this and tells the world about it. On the back of the paper is a photo of you! Yeah, you found out, congrats. You are a monster, how could you do such a thing? Do you even have a heart? And why are you still in this building? Calm down, let him speak. Do you forget why he did all of these? Let him explain himself. Sorry for that. <sighs> Antonia, for goodness sakes. I was pretty sick of all of these popular perfect on the internet students who think they can keep a good image while they destroy other people's lives as if they have no flaws. I wanted to teach them a lesson and make them feel what I felt. Sadly, the cycle escalated so quick that even innocent students and teachers got involved in this. Things got out of control. I didn't want this. And about the girl with the notebook that you mentioned before, yes, I took the paper with a password from her book. She didn't want to give it to me, so we fought a bit and she slipped and fell through that hole while we were pulling the book. I'm so sorry. I just want to keep her away from the safe. I have been hiding this building since the incident went public so the police doesn't arrest me. It was pretty selfish of me, I know. Antonio, why do you keep having sympathies for this man? I'm so sorry about your situation. Bloody criminal. It's up to you to decide if you want to tell the world about me and what I've done or if you are letting me get out of here and start a new life with a new identity. Of course, I'm going to post it online. Thank you for helping us solve a mystery, but sadly, we don't want criminals. Help criminals, sorry. So I'll make sure the whole internet sees what you've done and the police too. Sorry, but here's right. It's not fair for all the dead students if we leave you free. I know you were a victim at first, but destroying hundreds of lives is not too nice either. But it's not nice at all. The vlog went viral online, giving Antonia and Victor a lot of new subscribers and messages from the victims' his families thanking them for putting an end to the case. But Colbert is now in prison for all his life, with cellmates who beat him up daily. He had a few suicide attempts, but the security doesn't let him escape that easily. The school building was taken down, and all the victims found in it had a proper burial ceremony. And the credits follow. Thank you for playing my first game. Normal ending too, okay. The second normal ending. So I imagine the first normal ending would involve not posting the video online. Whoa, 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 whoa. what is this room? It looks like a red room. 
Maybe the principal got rid of the secretaries here. It looks like torture rooms for more movies, but smaller. It does look very, very gruesome. I say so myself. Body parts soaked in blood. Blood. More blood. Oh, there's a knife on there. There's a knife on the table. And there's a button on the table. Or something that looks like a button. Who knows? Don't post the video. You've been through enough pain. I don't want you to suffer even further. But what are you going to do from now on? And don't worry, we won't tell anyone about it. I'll say that I found nothing worth showing in a vlog. Firstly, I need to find a job to afford rent. Then, I'd like to pursue my hobby of being a cosplayer and fashion designer. But I'll need some surgery so police won't recognize me. Don't worry about surgery. Nobody on the internet knows you. And the people who got transferred are also probably too scared to say something. Also, makeup does wonders. So you can easily change your identity. If you want, I can also hire you as my personal fashion designer if your skills are good enough for my needs. Are you sure you want to trust him? What if he also blackmails you? Why would he do that if I want to help him? It won't help him. I won't, I won't want to make him suffer a single day of his life ever again. Why do you have so much empathy and want to help him so badly? Because he deserves it. I don't care if he killed all the people and did bad things. I still think he is just a misunderstood soul. I can feel that he has a good heart and a lot of potential. You are way too kind. Yep, mysterious student, you are definitely right. But I want to try and be your designer. I love artistic challenges and I'll do my best. Also, my name is Laurentier. Nice to meet you, Laurentier. Yeah, I feel that too, Victor. I miss my chance to tell you that I love her. Now she seems to hate me and start to feel emotions of this blank. Why am I so stupid? No, no, let's get out of here. Yes, let's get out of here with this murderer. Two years later, Antonia and her new designer, Lauren T, just got engaged. They started cosplaying together and making fashion vlogs. Victor broke his bond with Antonia and nobody knows what happened to him. The academy's still up and the ghosts of the victims still wander around it killing the visitors. Oh, dearie me, poor souls. And we need one. So we don't have our mysterious friend with us. So let's go down and see what we have down here. Um, the safe has a password. Yeah, I think we should try to explore some more to find the numbers. The weird white-haired guy said something about it. But it's better that he didn't come with us. We can find it by ourselves. Hmm. We know the password, but the game will not allow us to enter it. You need to unlock the safe if you want to get out. Oh, no, 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 this can't be happening. Are we stuck here and going to die for starvation? If we don't have a password, it would take an eternity to try all the number combinations to unlock it. Someone, please, open the door, please, ghost, please, please, I don't want to get in. It's no use. All we could do is wait here together to die. Can't we call someone to rescue us? I don't want to panic here, but the signal has stopped working since the moment we entered the building. I can only record, sorry. No, we are doomed. I can't. I can't die in here. I wish I could have done something to prevent this. Great. Bad end two. No, that is. <laughs> Thank you for playing my first game with a bad end. Do not worry. So, the first bad end which I discovered was without. Uh, without all of the ID tags, but it doesn't actually say bad end or anything like that. So we've got three shun ID tags. Tags can't go that way because I was trying to find a bad end one while trying to go for all this as well as the others, but it doesn't have like the title screen like bad end one or anything like that. So we get stopped here. Oh no, we're trapped. I recognize some of these ghosts. They are the owners of the sum of student IDs that we found. I told you we should gather them all. Now they're mad we didn't care about them to show the world what happened to them and they will kill us. Ouch. It's, yeah, it's too late. It just says game over. It doesn't have like a bad end one screen or anything like that. Because when you go to the endings guide, it says here, don't collect all student IDs. It doesn't matter if you have mysterious student in your team or 
not. So that, people, is Haunted Vlogs. I really like this game, actually. I like the um, artistic approach to it, but also like the simplistic kind of story throughout it. Like, it's not too complex at all, and doesn't really have, like, any in-depth layers about it, aside from the characters within the game itself, like Antonia and Victor. Like, you could try and fathom out like the kind of past that these two have had together but they don't seem too close at all it's just like they're acquaintances and nothing else like Victor's the cameraman and uh, Antonia's the vlogger but there doesn't really seem to have anything going on between the two that could kindle like some kind of friendship between one another like they're acquainted but I don't think they have any kind of friendship with one another in a way like friends would at a school for example and then they grow up together and they can do things together like friends would like pursue careers and stuff like that but i don't think this is one of those tales but i think these two they're just friends or acquaintances and that's it nothing bonding like with the mysterious student and antonia at the first normal end which i don't particularly like um antonia has a morbid sense of humor and when it comes to facing people in which she knows has committed murder she's like it doesn't matter because they've gone through lots of hysteria themselves from the bullying and stuff like that look it doesn't matter if you're bullied or not killing somebody does not <laughs> is not validated by being bullied in the past. Like, it doesn't matter what happened to you. Like, you can't just go around killing people. <laughs> and then a serious student is definitely a pickle to be around with. But he seemed to be just a tad bit more sane than Antonia throughout the game. And also all the different toilet papers throughout the game as well. <laughs> Almost like you have to wipe all the blood around the place with the toilet paper. But that is Haunted Vlogs, people. Thank you all so much for watching. If you've got anything to add towards the story of the vlogs that are haunted, then please, by all means, put them down in the comment section below. But also try this game out for yourselves and see what mysteries await for you that I may not have been able to cover. Thank you all so much for watching and take care of yourselves.